Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. So we got another unboxing video and this one is absolutely insane. Well, at least it looks like it from the pictures. So I did see this on Amazon and there's like a bunch of different styles. So I kind of went with one that I thought was gonna be pretty uh, kind of versatile or universal, whatever you wanna say it. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. And it's not typical, but usually Amazon stuff you would think comes in Amazon Prime. This is obviously a seller that was located in Mexico and it came in through DHL, which that process was actually kind of convenient. And I got emails knowing exactly when it was going to arrive. So let me go ahead and try to open up this and I'll be back in just one second. All right, so I'm getting the tape off of here. And as you can see, this is very well packaged. I'm actually really impressed. All right, you got rolled up cardboard, you got bubble wrap. Oh, okay, just <laughs> this right here is the item that we're excited about. It's gonna set all of this cardboard aside. <laughs> all right, there we go. So this is what I'm looking forward to. And I really, I mean, it's kind of hard to see from the pictures if this was gonna be like super fancy or if it was just something that you never know. So let's see if we can get this open and find out. I will say the care and dedication that went into uh, this packaging is absolutely amazing. So that right there is impressive. And if something does happen, and like let's say this would have got damaged in shipping, I guarantee you it was not. It would not be from the packaging because a lot of cardboard, a lot of bubble wrap, a lot of tape to hold everything in place. All right. You know I'm just gonna start ripping the bubble wrap at this point to get into it. Man, this is, I mean, this is a great problem to have. Alrighty, let's see here. I'm already seeing a little bit of it and it's already looking a little bit nicer than I expected. So that's always good. All right, let's see if I can just get through the layers of bubble wrap here. And there we go. Oh my gosh, this is actually really, really nice. Wow. So this right here is a really cool Hot Wheels display. And as you see, it's like the shape of the cards. And then you have like the Hot Wheels logo right there, which that is like the detail that went into that is amazing. Obviously it looks laser cut. But wow, I love this little detail. And that's actually why I got this one because some of the others, it's just plain. This is MDF board. So luckily this is perfect right here, like the little, the little tab. And it, it does also have a couple hanging points right here on the back. And then all of these are just like where these parts are just kind of like slid through. So I used to do a lot of woodwork and I can kind of smell like that this has been cut and actually I love that smell of like that charred wood and wow this is this is actually really impressive and it does have 11 spots right here so if you have cars that are opened up you can obviously set those here on the shelf and then you can slide carded cars you got two rows right here and I absolutely love this like like I said this was on Amazon there's gonna be a link in the description down below so you guys can go pick some of these up there's different styles there's some that have three rows of just the carded ones without these little cubbies. I wanted to have a little bit of both because I do have some open Hot Wheels. And with that six lane raceway that I just picked up, I'm gonna be opening up a lot more Hot Wheels to be able to race them on the track. And then maybe I'll have my different winners all the way down. And then as I get six or as this whole thing fills up, then I'll pull some of those off, run them again, and then the winner will remain. And then I'll just keep doing that to keep just like the champion cars. Um, I don't know, we will see. But I mean, you guys can see the size of this and it's a really good size. It's actually pretty light. You can kind of see the thickness right there of that MDF. And you can kind of see the thickness right here with the little shelves. But I really like this. The quality looks really, really good. And I don't know, I'm super excited to go ahead and start throwing some Hot Wheels in here. So let me grab some cars right now and just start sliding these down just to actually see how this works. Let me slide forward a little bit. 
All right, and I just want to make sure that, oh, the slots are perfect. They just fit in there nice and easy. There is a little bit of wiggle room, which is great, so you're not gonna be bending the cards, trying to like wedge them in there. And you can also move the cards forward a little bit to make sure you clear the card of the one below it. So those obviously look absolutely amazing in there. And let me go ahead and drop some on the other side just to make sure everything's good with this side, which so far it's looking absolutely amazing. Wow, this is actually turning out a bit better than I expected. And the fact that you can just put everything in this and then you just go hang it up on the wall. And like with the weight of everything, it's like the weight's nice and light. And that actually looks really professional, being able to display some of like your favorite cars. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill this whole thing up and I'll be right back. All right guys, so I went ahead and filled this up with a bunch of the carded cars. And currently I actually have 21 cars on here. This one is sticking up a little bit higher, but I feel like you could probably add, like let's see if you can add like maybe like one more. If you don't care about it sticking up, yeah, perfectly. I can add another one right there without it covering up the Hot Wheel logo. So that's 22 cars, I got 11 on each side. And I don't know, let's see if we can put one more in here maybe without blocking the, no, instead of block the Hot Wheel logo. I mean, you can still put another one on there, but right there, that looks super clean. And look at that, you get all the Hot Wheels lined up so you can get like your favorite cars. And then you still have all these cubbies. So whenever you have like the carded or the opened up cards, you can just set them on the shelf as well. And just like that, you can have all those cars lined up right there as well. So, I mean, technically it's 11, 11, and 11. So, I mean, 33 cars down this entire section, and I think this looks amazing. So, obviously, I would center those cars a little bit better. You can see they're kind of moving around a little bit. But it does have plenty of room that if you want to put, like, a bigger car in there or some of those where it's, like, a truck or something, they definitely will fit. But this is a really nice build quality. And you can kind of see, like, right here, all these little tabs. That's where the shelves are being able to kind of go through so everything is like locked together. It's been cut and nicely fitted. It looks like it's been laser cut, I believe, on like everything. I mean, these edges are immaculate and this thing is honestly really high quality. So for the price that this was, I don't remember the exact price, but honestly, I was like, okay, that seems like a decent price. Like, let me get in and see how it goes. But now after like getting this and seeing it, like the price was absolutely amazing. So there's gonna be links in the description down below. So definitely hop on Amazon, pick these up because these look great. And I'm super excited to be able to hang this up on the wall. And yes, with all the cars, it does have like a little bit of weight to it. So you definitely don't wanna just like sticky something on the wall. Definitely put like a nail or something in there or maybe some screws or some of those like little mounting things that can hold a lot of weight. But I think this looks amazing. Let me know down in the comments down below what you guys think. And also, I believe there's another one that has five rows for the carded. And in the past, I never really cared to display them like this. But after seeing this, I'm probably going to get a couple more of these things. And I love having these open ones, too, because the like Speed Machine set came in the crate. So I was able to take all those cars out of the little crate. They're not carded. So I was able to like drop these in here, be able to display them, check them out. Also, like some of the ones I really love that I wanted to put like on my desk. I can at least throw in here for now or maybe just swap out. But yeah, definitely let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this. And links in the description down below for all kinds of stuff. You guys can see I have these Amazon black boxes over here and I do uh, case unboxing videos all the time. So definitely hit that subscribe button. Link in the description down below for the Amazon black boxes as well. But like, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.